here I'm going to discuss another question where we're going to combine the two cubes together and we're going to find out the uh, total surface area. Let me read the question. Two cubes, each of volume 64. So uh, each of volume 64. From here, what we need to understand that the both cube, uh, it's a cube, all right? So both of the cube are looking same. If, if the question was uh, two cuboid of volume 64, it might be different. But here the question is saying two cubes, Cubes means uh, length, breadth, and height all are same. So both of the cubes has length, breadth, and height same. And each of uh, have the volume of 64 centimeter cube, all right? Are joined end to end. Find the surface area of the resulting cuboid, all right? So the question is saying we had two cuboid, all right? Let me, uh, let me say this is my first cube, all right? Though it's not looking, it's not looking, it will be very good. <laughs> but you understand like a cube. All right, this is the cube and, and exactly same one more cube we have, all right? So uh, further, what we're going to do, we're going to combine both of the cube together, all right? And after combination of those both cube, the figure will be something like this. Something bigger it will be and it will be no longer cube. Now it will be a cuboid, all right? After combination, it will look like this, you know? So here, a few, a few information has been given. The, each of the cube has the volume of 64 centimeter cube. All right, volume is 64 cube centimeter cube. Here is also volume 64 centimeter cube. All right. So from here, actually, the volume is given so we can find out the length or breadth or height, whatever you say, because all of them are same. All right. So what we have learned that uh, the volume of a cube, you know, uh, volume of any cube, volume of cube equals to the side cube, you know side cube and the volume is here uh, how much 64 so 64 centimeter cube equals to side cube or just simply you can write a cube all right so further 64 what i can write 64 is the four centimeter cube and this is also side cube so this cube this cube cancel and we get as side equals to four centimeter so what we get information from here that our uh, this cube has the side of 4 cm. It means length is also 4 cm, breadth is also 4 cm, and definitely height is also 4 cm. So this will be also 4 cm, this will be also 4 cm, and then height will be also 4 cm. So after combination, you know, actually this is made with the two, uh, uh, made with the two, two cube, you know. So these are actually two cubes. This was 4, and this was 4. So all together what we get, we get the total length as a 8 centimeter all right length is 8 centimeter and at the same time see this is 4 centimeters so this 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 4 centimeter will be here also you know so the breadth is 4 centimeter it's centimeter all right and now next thing is the height this is 4 centimeter height this is also 4 centimeter height so uh, definitely this height will be 4 centimeter uh, from here to here so now we just have to find out the total surface area of this new cube, all right, cuboid. So what will be the surface area of this new cuboid? And we know very well that the surface area of the new cuboid will be same as other cuboids. And the formula for the total surface area of the cuboid is two times LB, length times breadth, length times height, plus breadth times height, all right? Uh, this is a simple, you know, total surface area of a cuboid. Uh, I hope you are remembering the formula, total surface area of the cuboid. That's 2 times LB plus LH plus BH. Here, LB and H represents the length, breadth, and height. So, uh, actually, you know, uh, if you see length and breadth, this is length and this is breadth. So, this is representing this uh, surface. And exactly similar surface we have at the top also. All right. So, length and breadth, how many times? Two times. Similarly, length and height. We have this length and we have this height. So uh, here I'm talking about this particular surface and exactly similar surface we have another side also. So that's why twice of length and height. And now breadth and height. If you see breadth and height, this is breadth. Uh, let me do with uh, this color. All right. This is your breadth and this is your height. So I'm talking about this surface and exactly similar surface we have this side also. So that's why twice of breadth and height. All right. So now let's calculate everything. Two times length. Length is eight centimeter. All right, and breadth is four centimeter plus length is again eight centimeter and height is also four centimeter. And again, breadth is four centimeter and height is also four centimeters, four times four. So it's going to be two times eight times four, that is 32. Uh, eight times four, that is again 32. And four times four, that is 16. 
So 32, 32, 64, 64 and 16, 80 and 80 times 2 that is 160 centimeters square. And so this is the total surface area of the new cuboid that we formed after the combination of the two cubes whose volume were 64 centimeter cube uh, of each. All right. This is how we need to understand the question first and we need to solve. All right. So first, better I will tell you, understand the question, try to figure out uh, what it is and try to represent in diagram. And once you understand into the diagram and it's very easy what is the next step for you to do to solve that question. All right. Uh, if there is any confusion or anything you need to ask me, then please feel free to comment below this video. I'll definitely reply back and see you in the next video, guys. Bye-bye.